What's up guys, my name is Cody Coetz. I guide on the Muskegon River for a fly fishing guide for salmon, trout, and steelhead. And then I also guide up on the Naknek River in Alaska for um, salmon, big rainbow trout, arctic char, all that fun stuff. But today, I'm gonna be talking about the Corkers K5 Bomber. I just got off the water um, steelhead fishing and I wanted to give a little uh, insight on this new wading boot that I've been using. Um, so it's, first things first, it's uh, laces, not boa, and then it has the removable sole, and these are the Klingon bottoms, and not the, not the studs today. Um, this is an awesome wading shoe. Uh, they're super light, but yet really durable and comfortable, and they support you, your, your ankle, or your foot and your ankle. So, so they're really comfortable. They support your foot and your ankle with, um, they call it bi-zonal laces. So the laces are put right in place so they can lock your ankle down nice and tight. So when you're wading, you're rolling over big rocks, it protects you, you don't roll your ankle out and you know end your day right there. Um, they're really, really nice for hiking because of that too. They have lots of lightweight, uh, it's all synthetic fabrics. So they're really lightweight even though they're pretty tough. And then with those synthetic fabrics, what you get is a super fast drying shoe. So today it's uh, it's raining out, so they're not gonna get dry anytime soon. But on most days, I'll throw them in the car or after I'm done fishing and they'll dry out. Usually by the time I get home, almost, if I, I'll be sitting in the passenger seat underneath the blower and they're ready to get thrown inside right after that. So the, the materials they used in this are awesome, not only for the lightweight and the drying abilities, but they're super durable. So I've had these shoes for about six or seven months now, and I guide in them like five days a week, probably average, average out like that. And um, I mean, they're a little dirty. I was out waiting in them today, but I mean, the stitching's all in place. There's no problems with that. The stitching's good. Um, the soles are all intact. A lot of people are scared about their removable soles at the fallout, but these have been actually working perfect. So, with the replaceable sole like this, um, I have the, the Klingon, and then I also have the studs. But me, I have a fiberglass boat and a raft, so the studs don't always work. Um, they'll tear up the boat and they'll maybe pop the raft, but this is very sticky on its own for when you have to get out of the boat and drag it up and down. But with the replaceable soles, you have the option to switch in and out whenever you want. So if I'm not gonna take the boat, I can swap out, put the studs in, a couple minutes, boom, ready to go. But most part, most part I've been using just the Klingon, and for when I need them, they work awesome. So this has been my review on the Corker K5 Bomber wading boot. I'm gonna give it a thumbs up and recommend it to anyone who's looking for a boot at this time. Um, I've been using it for about six, seven months, like I said, and I love it. I take them on all sorts of adventures, and they haven't failed me yet. So, thanks for watching, guys.